Houston, say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey there folks, welcome to part 4 of Wasteland 2 on the PS4. And the point we left it at part 3, I haven't moved. There's been a bit of a day's gap between the recording, so I'm just remembering where we were. <laughs> uh, we'd come up from the basement area, and I'd gone to see the professor lady at the top entrance there to see if we'd managed to finish the quest for getting all the items from the pods in order to find a cure because as you can see on the bottom left there we've all got little green symbols above our heads bar one person which means we're all infected I've got a horrible feeling that uh, we're all going to turn into giant tomatoes <laughs> or something like that uh, so yeah so I came up hoping that she might give us a cure as it happens she said to come back later and she'll have a cure for us so we can only hope there's enough time and uh, we're going to go back into the basement now There was a lot of areas we couldn't get into. We did, at the end of part three, also level up. So I did manage to give people other abilities. We're going to have a look at that again in a second. can't remember who I gave what to, to be honest. I think we gave somebody lockpicking. We gave somebody demolition. Hopefully it's enough to get us through a bit of the uh, locked areas that were down there. I'm pretty sure you must be able to get around these areas without having to do that, but it might make our lives easier for sure. Okay, so we're back in this room where it's a central area and we can open either the door at the top there the door behind us or the door to the right which is already open which is poisoned as it happens okay we're gonna have to have another quick run around here you guys will probably remember more than I do as to what I've done and what I haven't done there was a door to the left through here which we'd been in and I managed to destroy an herb which we could have taken but I hadn't quite twigged that I needed my outdoorsman to do the to do that Alright, let's see. We're going to have a look through here. Everybody stay there. Uh, uh, yeah, well, it doesn't matter now, does it? Because everybody's injured anyway. I think we'll take one of the people that can heal themselves. Probably is the best bet. I'll take Bear, actually. Where is she? That's not her. That's her. <clears throat> and let's go. Okay. The poison seems to wear off by itself. It takes a few points off you and then... That's it. It did say something about turning all the fans on though, didn't it? And then that should get rid of the poison, but it never seemed to. Unless I'm missing a fan somewhere down the line. So... Oh, hang on a minute, that's not on, is it? Or is that not... I'm not allowed to use... Oh, yeah. Oh, that turns the top one off. All right. I don't know what that's all about then. Right, anyway, <clears throat> let's open this door. Or not. On the other side of the wall, an enormous... Oh, that was just what we did there. Uh, I thought we'd been through this door already. Oh, right, no, it's locked, isn't it? No, yeah, no, that's right. We couldn't get through there because of the poison. Right, okay. Sorry folks, you're seeing a bit of the same thing again, because I've forgotten where the hell I was <laughs> what I was doing. Okay, let's try the south one. <clears throat> Okie doke. And we'll take everyone. Come on, folks. Big party, isn't it, now? Oh, hang on a minute. This is new. I don't think we tried the south one, did we? You found the mushroom cave. That's where Dr. Larson did all his fungal research. I'm seeing a lot of movement in Whoa. there. None of it looks human. Thank you. Right, you lot come back here. We'll take one person out, get these pods exploded.
I'm not sure if collecting more is uh, any use, but we'll take them anyway. There's a giant mushroom in there that's got all sorts of things. Uh... Whoa, there's something flying around here. Let's get the different camera on. Yeah, there he is. Giant fly! That's going to annoy me, that. <laughs> Keep hitting the wrong camera and then getting the... Uh... Well, we've got a fight to have. How many of them are there? Uh, there's, a, oh, there's an exploding zombie guy in here. Well, plant guy, as it is. Right, okay, I'll tell you what we'll do. Let's see if they can... Uh... Let's get the team up with me. Come on up. Come on up. Just so we're not too far away. Let's get them to spot us. Can't seem to activate the fight until they see us, which is a bit annoying. In in XCOM, it was uh, you could just make your moves until you got close enough. There we go. Ooh, ouch! Should really have reloaded things before I got back into it, shouldn't I? Right. I think we need to get closer for a start. -off. Well, I don't know if we should probably uh, not get flanked either. Let's just have a look. There's a zombie guy up there. I'm going to call him zombie guy because I keep saying it automatically. Oh, there's... Oh, Jesus. There's a few of them. I'm hoping they kind of explode, maybe. Just anyway. <laughs> when you shoot them once, but I doubt it. Uh, okay, yeah. We'll send somebody there. And hope they get a name on something. Can't do ambush. Need to end turn there, I think. What? They've got three hits on her now. Let's get into cover. If we can't. No, I can't cover there. Well, we're going to be out in the open anyway, so I might as well... They're all 45%, even though one's right next to me. If that's, <clears throat> might be harder for them to hit me if I'm uh, further back there. Oh, never mind. Let's just get some shots in from here. Right. Staying inside the blue square at the minute, I think. It's a shame that that plant's there. We can't hide behind here. Or it doesn't seem to give us cover if we do. She's a shotty person anyway, so... I think we'll get her to there behind cover from at least the things on the right. That was a bit silly, actually, because I think I've put... Uh, I think I've put both the healers together. I'll sort that in a second. Oh, she's just gone mental again. Look at her. Go on. Go on, Rose. She's mental. Old ladies are angry. No. Uh... Yeah, we don't necessarily want him taking on uh, exploding people, do we? I think that's a bad idea. I need to get him up to the flies, really. Can we go that far up? And go to there. I don't know if he can hit them in the air, though. Okay. Go on, beast. Quads! Hang on, can he hit anything from here? Oh my god, Steve. Sort the camera out. Doesn't seem to suggest he can, does it? I 
can't seem to get that camera to do what I want to do. Here we go. It's definitely not got a name on. They're outside. That's what the red circle is, isn't it? The red circle is showing me how far they can shoot. Sorry, I'm a bit slow. Let's see if we can get it from there. Yeah, that's better. Okay, let's hope for some good uh, luck here. Nice work. That was an ambush shot. This could get nasty, couldn't it? Could get nasty quick, this. Everyone's together as well. Let's flank them. Seventy-eight percent. Oh no! <laughs> I didn't see that there. Take the shot. Nice, nice, nice. Do it again. Oh, go on. That's brilliant. Missed. <laughs> Here we got sixty-eight. Oh, sixty percent. Sure, why not? Take that one down, eh? Nice. So there's a definite bonus to shooting them from a distance because look at that mist that came off them. It's got to be some sort of poison, isn't it? Uh, still got enough for another shot, I think. Let's try and take out that one. It's got a little bit of health left. Ah, damn it. That's interesting. Why is it giving me a line of sight? Just telling me that I can, I suppose. I think we'll do a an ambush on her because he might get closer. She's got the shotty. Just watch those health bars. Who's this? I see. I'm on the sniper, dude. Just maybe just get to here. I think. The thing is, I need to be careful, don't I? Because the line of sight could be a problem. That one should be okay. Nice, nice, nice. Go on, go on, Rose. I will end your suffering, young one. <laughs> oh, go on. That answers that question about him hitting stuff in the air, doesn't it? Oh, go on. Stitches just hit him. He's shotty. Okay, I don't want to be next to that thing when it pops. Uh, okay. I think, oh, okay. So what we'll do. We'll go to here. And T, oh no, that's going to pop as well, isn't it? I think what we'll do is we'll go to there. And then we'll shoot it from there. Seems reasonable. Oh, how's it not dead? Come on. Yeah, flee, 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 fly. Hit me on, hit me on. That's going down, that one. Let's have it. He gone, he gone. Okay, just end the turn. There's nothing dangerous up there anyway. Actually, you can stay where you are. What? How can I not do a reaction shot with her? Oh, rewind. Uh, rewind? <laughs> reload, even. Must remember to reload outside of battle, folks. Let's just have a look. Don't think he's got a shot on, has he? Oh, look, something's dropped on the floor. I'm having a bit of that. Yeah, he's not got a name on there. So, we'll stick him into... Oh, hang on, we'll move him to there and we'll stick him on... Ambush. Ooh, he eh? flanked and spanked. Let's have it. 
Not bad. Go on. Go team! Woohoo! Good little fight that. Enjoyed that. Nice work. <laughs> I love that noise at the end. Ding ding ding. What's this? It's a sack full of pus. Awesome! That's just what I always wanted. Oh, shucks, you guys. <laughs> Who doesn't want a sack full of pus? Come on now. Be honest about it. Ooh, we're going in there in a minute. Right, when does she stop being poisoned, please? Actually, everyone's health's not too bad. A bit of that. Did we get that? Yeah, we've got that one. One exploded somewhere. We didn't get the stuff out of it. Here we go. <gasps> Another sack full of pus. It's my birthday. Uh, I was trying to... <laughs> I was trying to see if... She did say at one point, if you can get me a whole one without it exploding, but uh, that didn't seem to work, did it? Let's not do that again. Uh, I'm wondering if there is something that needs to get this poison off me. It's usually gone by now. Uh, yeah, see down at the bottom left there, we've got a poison marker. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. She ain't looking too good. How do I see? I mean, it tells you what it tells you that there's something wrong at the top left, and we can assume it's poisoned simply because it's green. But does it actually tell us anywhere? Would be my question. I'm not sure if any of these actually. I think I think they just give us our health back. I don't think they cure anything. Yeah, it's not cured it. I don't know how to cure stuff. We're going to have to find that out. Or it just wears off and we have to just survive until it does, maybe. We will go in that room in a minute, folks. I haven't forgotten about it. Uh, oh, hello. There's another one. Oh, who's got the shovel? Uh, let's have a look. <clears throat> Someone's got a shovel. Oh, there they are. This is quite cool, actually, because what you can do is you can give it to the person that's scouting. And move it to them. Although, intro oh, that's interesting. Why can't I move it to the person I'm on? That's the other guy, and that's Rose, I think, that one. Alright, I wonder if there's... Okay, maybe not as cool as I thought, then. Alright, Stitches. I wonder, if maybe it's a, a downside of being poisoned or something, then. Don't know. Can she not see? Is it blinded or something, maybe? Don't know. I am pissing in the wind for an answer to that one. <laughs> I think that's the phrase to use. Ooh. Kaboom! Lovely. Aha! There's, oh, there's a guy. Uh, yeah, the last time we walked up to this, it, it killed them. The plants are so tightly bound into the poor sod that even they're greatly skilled, even, sorry, only someone greatly skilled in handling plants or treating the gravely wounded might be able to extract them. Otherwise, you'll need to find a way to weaken the plants before they, they can escape. Well, okay, so let's just read that again. Only someone greatly skilled in handling plants. Okay, that's our outdoors person. Or treating the gravely wounded, which is stitches. 
Bear is no longer afflicted by a fly bale. Oh, nice. Yeah, there you go. It's worn off by itself. That's good. Right, okay. Well, we're going to have to try this. He could die, but... Uh, get away. I can feel them under my skin. They'll cut me apart if I move. Hmm. Surgeon. Uh, 15%. So it might not be... Uh, oh, she got outdoorsman as well. Zero percent. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, let's just take her away a second and move to... It's quite cool. They stay in the positions, I think, where you left them as well when you go solo. Oh god. Yeah, bollocks. <laughs> right, okay, we're going to have to figure that out then. I've, I've no idea. I, I think our skills must be too low to do anything about it, maybe. Or maybe I should have examined it again. But her... See, that's weird, because I thought... Unless I'm on the wrong character here. But I thought... She had the outdoorsman skill. Although, no, uh, yeah, it's, she has, it's just that she can't use it just now. Right, okay. Radio, okay, let's go look in the room, folks. Nope, not there. Although, was there not... Uh... Just double-check that we didn't miss anything up here. Oh, hang on. There just seemed to be another way to go up there, didn't there? And another exploding plant jobber. So we're going to investigate this room, and then we'll head out that way. Ooh, hello, shiny. Go away, Sergio. <sighs> What's that? Energy weapons. Designed by Dr. Ryan Herbison as a handheld weed killer for giant weeds and nicknamed Herbicide in his honour. The good doctor thought it would prove equally effective against giant mushrooms and thus changed its name to Fungicide. Unfortunately, Herbison was killed by an exploding pod person before he was able to test the hypotheses. Unfortunate. Uses energy cells. Energy weapons cannot jam or inflict critical hits, but deal bonus damage to targets with conductive armor. Yes, we mentioned that, didn't we, in another another play? Armor damage multipliers, conductive 2.5 and non-conductive 0.4. Lovely. This researcher's corpse is wearing a smiling photo ID badge labelled Ryan Herbison. Yeah, it was his gun, wasn't it? Died reaching for his herbicide oh, gun. Sergio. Who the hell is speaking? Who's Sergio? What? Go away, Sergio. The woman's fingernails are splintered and bent back. It looks like she was clawing at something. It also looks like she sh took a shotgun blast to the face. Jesus. Someone's hiding in the closet. The scratches on this door look like they were made with fingernails. There is also blood. Uh, it did give us an X, didn't it? In the first instance, maybe not. Oh, nice. Ammo! Ammo, I keep waiting for one of these to explode. Just as a side note, I have started downloading the closed beta for Fable Legends on the Xbox One as I signed up for it and I got an email today. <clears throat> so I will probably take a little evening off of this tomorrow and uh, give it a go and record it for you guys to see and post it up shortly afterwards the following morning for anyone that's interested. Okay, who's saying that? Let's do me head in. Must be through these doors, surely. Do I need a lock, a lock picker? Hang on. Who's our lock picker, folks? Ah, it's our sniper. I like when you change in the menu. You come out of the menu. It, it's on that character. I like that. Go away, Sergio.
No, it's just not letting us open that. I don't know who's saying it. I assume they're behind that door. Anything else in this room that can get us in there? Go away, Sergio. Hmm. Go away, Sergio. Okay. Well, in the meantime, let's uh, try out the guns we just picked up. I'm wondering who we should give it to. Has anyone got the heavy weapon, uh, the energy weapons perks? I'm not sure. Sniper rifles, one sort of thing, mechanical repair, blah. Computer science. Yeah, there isn't anyone with anything to do with... Yeah, there's energy weapons there. No, I haven't got anyone that's learnt it, I don't think. But it'd be a good backup weapon for someone, I suppose. Yeah, none of them have got it. Next upgrade, maybe. We'll give it to... We could give him a, a, a second option, couldn't we? In case he can't run up to things and lob them on the head. He's only got three things at the minute, so... Or we could give it to Stitches. I don't want to give it to someone that's going to vanish on us. Where's Stitches at? There she's there. Oh, she's got a secondary weapon, hasn't she? Look. She's got that beast of a short-range weapon. Seems a bit daft for her to have two short-range weapons, though, doesn't it? Two barrels of murder with classic twist kicks like a mule, yeah. Because that's basically a, almost like a shotgun pistol style, isn't it? So if we take that off of her... And give that... To Bear... Um, actually, I might give it... Yeah, no, give it to... Give it to Bear. And if we go to Bear... And give that to Stitches. We'll equip that as her secondary. Actually, no, I'll tell you what. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I was thinking about giving it to uh, Quads, but we'll give it to her. Okay, equip. Secondary weapon. There you go, she's got an assault rifle and there's something for a bit up close and personal then, isn't she? And then the same with... Uh... <clears throat> that will equip that as her primary. And we'll equip the shotty as a secondary. Seems reasonable. Got loads of stuff in here we'll need to have a look at at some point. I like the fact they've all got their own little inventories. I think it's quite cool. I like the inventory system, actually. It's done really well. Oh, hello. What's that? Faded letters. Each of these letters is faded and yellowed with age and use. To my angel is scrawled on the front in loving, slightly messy handwriting. Could be that there's little quests hidden in these, I don't know. Go away, Sergio. Ah, it's not gonna let us in there, is it? Right, screw you. No idea who you are, can't get into it. <laughs> I'm leaving you there. Did that do everybody? I think it did. Yeah. I assume that might be the only tunnel that we were about to run through. It did say try and save these folk, but I certainly couldn't see any way into that guy. It won't give me an option to 
open the door. I was convinced it gave us an option to open the door, but the minute I hit triangle, it would only give me triangle again. Whoa, back, 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 back. God damn it. Come on. Boom. What we got? What we got? Another one. I'll tell you what we haven't done, folks. We have not. Saved for ages, <laughs> which could be quite concerning. Now let's get in there. Good job I remembered there. I could have got caught short in the next fight, couldn't I? Oh, hello. We've got evil. We've got bad ones up here. Get up here, team. Come on, team. There they come. Right. Jesus Christ, they're bloody everywhere, those things. Ah, ah, I've just found a good way of, uh, yeah, I've just, I've just twigged to something here, folks. You might have seen me, uh, now that I know I can move them individually and leave them there, it's a good, uh, good way of splitting them up for fights, isn't it? Start using that more often. Okay, she's got her energy weapon on as it happens, but we're gonna just shuffle her back here. What? 18% chance of hitting it? In God's name. How is her line of sight, that? Oh wait, no ammo, is that what it is? People, I've got to start reloading. <laughs> I think, right, I think it only reloads the weapons that are equipped by the looks of it. I have to watch out for that. 60%. Actually, I'll move the... I don't want to get in the way of the sniper, so... Actually, I'll stay here. Take a shot, I think. Let's do an ambush. <laughs> what? Ooh, I think it missed. It's quite useful. Oh, for God's sake, get out. You fired. Go on, Rose. <laughs> Leave it to the old lady, she'll sort it all out. I will end your I'll end your suffering, young pod person. For God's sake, how on earth did you miss that? God, they're well two together, aren't they? Oh, nice. Go on. No. Don't want them exploding all over us. Oh, Jesus. She's got a shotty on now, I think. Oh my god, seriously? So annoying. Who's this? You gotta unjam and then miss a turn. It's a bit annoying that. Can I move? Yeah, I can. It's 
stitches, no! Whoa, she just got poisoned with some purpley shiz, didn't she? Oh, he's not got an aim on now. Let's get him up to here. I imagine you could have hit the little... Yeah. 62% on both of them. God damn it! Take one for the team here, quads. Get him. Go get him. Ooh, nearly. Right, he's out of shots as it happens. Come back here in case he explodes. Go on, Rose. Shoot him. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, nicely done. Right, you're actually going to hit something, Stitches. Come on, do it. No, get out. Just get out. No good to me. Man, you're covered in purple shiz as well, aren't you? It's not helpful. <laughs> what is wrong with these people? Even I could shoot it from there. Let's stick him on a uh, ambush, I think, at the minute. How many people are going to get a shot at this caterpillar? It's not even moving. <laughs> no. <laughs> Who's next? Alright, go on. Hit it. Can you hit it from there? Go on. Yay! Finally! Quad says come back! Nice work. Apart from that one caterpillar, guys, seriously. What was going on with that? We'll have to have a staff meeting to discuss what went wrong there with that caterpillar. Lovely. It's all the animal in it's picked up. Okay, let's just have a reload session, shall we? Oh, hang on, I'm not on team, am I? Nice, nice, nice. Okay. What do we got? What do we got? No, oh, we seem to have yeah, we picked that up on the way in, didn't we? Well, there's another one. They're everywhere, these bloody things, aren't they? Aha! Now then, I think we have... Verdant and unforgiving. This dense mass of vegetation has completely blocked the path, unless it can somehow be weakened. Nothing short of heavy artillery will be enough. I, um, I want... De de um, I had a feeling that Demolition might have worked on that. Who did we give Demolition to? Was it the big fella? Yeah, it's unavailable. I'm sure it was him though. I think I might be thinking of the, the blocked up doors or something. But I know... I will get used to what these people have, people, I promise. Yeah, I gave him demolition, so if it was possible, he'd have the option to do it, which we don't. Heavy artillery, though, I don't know what the hell that's going to be. Okay, nothing up there. Is this... Oh, hello. Stitches, knee jerk, shovel. Nice. I'll have a good sort through all of this uh, stuff we're picking up, I think, off camera. In the main part, I mean, I'll show you stuff, obviously, but uh, 
Not sure how interesting it'll be to watch me go through menus or not. I think that actually took some health off me there. So is there no... I thought there was another way into the... Uh, Every single route we take is blocked, and I don't know what the answer to the conundrum is. Every time I think we've found another way through, it's, it's blocked in the same manner. I mean, we could go back, actually, now that we've got demolition on the, the big fella. We could go back and see if we can blow up the, the doors or whatever it was that was blocking for that angle. I think there was also a locksmithing one. Possibly. But that was all in the west wing of the uh, thing, I think. Might as well collect these. Oh, Jesus Christ, two of them. Okay, nothing more down there. Copy Echo One. Copy Echo One. Appreciate the update. Just thought I'd quickly check and see if we had any upgrades. But we don't. Actually, yeah, sorry, I just realised that little yellow bar at the bottom left underneath their health, I think that might well be their level up statuses, maybe. All right, let's have one last look in here and see if we can figure out how to get through to this guy. Go away, sir. Go away, Sergio. Hmm. Has to be something we're missing in this room. Go away, Sergio. Quite clearly meant to speak to that guy. Go away, Sergio. Go away, Sergio. There's another door there, which looks like it's blocked. Yeah, so there's a safe. There's loads of stuff back there. But we need to figure out how to get through these doors. I'm just looking at the stitches said all is well just checking in to let you know blah go away Sergio a sign on this door reads fertilizer storeroom warning toxic chemicals you can hear sobbing coming from behind it I mean, it glows green, so why won't it let us... It was him we gave lockpick into, and he can't do anything. Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Oh, God damn it. That is what we need to do, though. But he can't do it. Or we can use... Ah, I see how it's working now, folks. So... Everybody come back here. Let quads in. Go away, Sergio. Oh. <laughs> what? How has he not got brute force? I was... That's weird. Right, okay. Can't see how it'll work away, for him, Sergio. but he's only got 15%. Nah, I can't. Um, can 
Can we cycle through characters? Oh, hang on. Cycle objects. What's that object? It's... Oh, is that the boxes we've already picked up? Woman. Right, okay. Right, team. We need another plan. Put on an egg fire. You think we'd have found one way through by now? Come on, team. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go back into the west wing. Oh, hello. Hang on. Is there anything else we can do? Does this just shut the door or what? What does this do? Yeah, it does, yeah, I think. That's pointless. Okay. So, have a quick save. Blooming heck, eh? Been in it for 45 minutes and I've got nowhere. <laughs> well, I've done some good fights, though. East ventilation shaft, three of five active. Engine, engage all fans to evacuate airborne toxins. Yeah, so we've only got three in that east one, haven't we? So, I think we need to do a bit of each to then get them all going, though. So, let's get back through the west one and see if we can blow up one of these doors or something. Oh, whoa, whoa, Jesus Christ. I forgot there was poison in here. Alright, this is bad, this is bad. Get out, folks, get out. Jesus. One, one person, one person. <laughs> that could have been monumentally bad, couldn't it? Right, let's try that again. Who's got the demolition? It's him, isn't it? And his health seems to be not too bad, okay. It's unavailable, isn't it? I'm not understanding that one. Barb tendrils envelop everything below, barring your way. The plant need. Yeah, I know he is. Jesus Christ. Right. That can't be turned on, can it? <laughs> this is going bad, isn't it? I'm forgetting everything, and I can't figure out how to hell get through these doors. I tell you what, let's get through this. There was another way out of this one, I'm sure there was. Yeah, here we go. What? I wonder if a locksmith can get through that one. Finally! Go on! Oh god, I'm still getting poisoned. Right. It looks like a giant fly used its overgrown was to chew through the blah. Computer repairs we need on that. Okay, let's get him back. Jesus Christ, the health's going down well fast. Right, let's just have a healing moment here. Oh, we're through one door, folks. Woohoo! I 
think... Did I not give them to... Yeah, I gave it to Stitches. Right, Stitches, you're up. Computer skills required. That surgeon. Why was she all right? Oh, nice. Ooh. Check that out, folks. Check that out. Right, we'll just get a... Hang on. Necessary, necessary. That'll do it. This is Highpool calling anyone. Can anyone hear me? SOS! The Rectors have knocked down our tower. I don't know if we're even transmitting. Can anyone hear me? Actually, just anyone? before I do that... Hi, Poole, this is Rachel. Oh, hang on, that cleared the gas, didn't it? You copy? You are still transmitting. Before we turn that on, though... Can anyone hear me? Hi, Poole. Ah, anyone? it's another way up, isn't it? Please send help. Our walls are crumbling. We... What does this do? So we can turn it on from both sides, which is pretty cool. Okay, I wonder if we should bring everybody through here and then go up the stairs. Come on, team. They should be on their way, in theory. Are they coming? Here they come. Good stuff. Right, everybody up here. And they didn't get poisoned, which means the fan must be on. Progress, people, progress. Right, we'll do is we'll have a little save that. No, oh, we can't. Not allowed to save that, right? Okay, up we go. Whew, finally, that felt good actually. I like in the little puzzles though. I tell you what though, I'm glad I gave him the new skills because I've got no idea how I would have got out of there. <laughs> like we used two of the new skills there, lock picking and computer skills. We're only given. Rangers, you're going into the outer fields now. I'm afraid our camera coverage is a lot spottier out there, so I won't be able to help as much. Good luck. Welcome to the West Field, Rangers. Lots of experimental fruits and veg, not to mention a large rabbit population, so it's sure to be dangerous. Find the generator that's gone off the rails and find some way to get it back online. Do not just blow it up. I know that comes naturally to meatheads like you, so try to... All right, stroppy pants. Right, we say we're going out here, but I still don't have any way of getting past this door, do I? <laughs> because I'm almost positive we don't have anything that can demolish those... There might be something in that crate though, right enough. Barb Thames will envelop everything below, barring your way. The plants will need to be cut away or blown up before you can pass. Yeah. And we don't have... Demolition. We do have... Yeah. Table that. <clears throat> well, that was a short lived piece of excitement. <laughs> then we're going to have to go back down. It is confusing when it gives you the use symbol, though. In Can't do anything with it. Just 
going through the uh, people here to see if there's anything we can use, but it looks like not. There's seven objects in this room. Well, where, oh, that's not the room, is it? It's the area. That's back down the hole. That's outside the room. That's outside the room. Nah. We ain't getting past those. Oh, hello. Right, okay, we're going to have to go back down again. That's okay. I think the uh, the central point underneath was... It had more fans to turn on anyway. My concern is that we don't have... Uh, I must have missed something. I mean, they wouldn't make a game you couldn't get around, obviously. And, you know, me missing things is fairly part of the norm. <laughs> All right, she'd actually run out of ammo. Oh, shit, no, don't do that. Easy. Okay. Everybody through. Right, we'll get back. Oh, hello. Didn't see that, did we, eh? A few small cracks bisect this old stone wall. Use a little force and the wall should come down. Sweet. Well, we do have someone with a little force, as it happens. Oh, hello. Boom! Good girl. Hi, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't see you there. Okay. No, oh, I was going to try and sneak around, but no. Okay, that's going to blow up. She's out of control. She's going. Go on, girl. What? <laughs> She's going mental. A pod person is immune to... I think it's a physical attack, possibly. Right. I think this is stitches as it happens. Not enough AP, fair enough. Go on. Oh, you're rubbish. You fired. Oh, nice. May have taken a little bit of health off the other girl, but it's her own fault for running and punching shit, and I didn't tell her to. Rose, I'm surprised she didn't run off going all mental. Go on, Rose. Take him out. Jesus Christ. I thought I was aiming at the guy in front of me. I was aiming at a fly. Go on, beast. Go on, quads. No, you can't get that far. I'll flank him for the next move. Beast. No. Stop it. Why is she using her fists? Is she out of ammo? Uh, yeah, she is, isn't she? God damn it. Angela Death. Well, the thing is, what kind of ammo do we need to give her? That's your hip. 
Um, That's weird, she does have it. Unless we picked up ammo after she'd run out or something, maybe. <laughs> that was worth it, wasn't it? She didn't even hit it. God damn you. Why I oughta. Go on, Stitches. Doctor shot. Duck, 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 duck to shot. Do 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 do. Hopeless. Hopeless. Oh, that's not Rose. That was Bear. Good girl. Sniper. Sniper shot. Do it. Woohoo. Go team. Good work. Clear out this room, I think. There was another weak wall there, I think. Demolition was... Uh, yeah, I think we may have had somebody with demolition before we started all of this, so we were... It, it seems to be that some... You'll have one thing, at least, I think, that will get you by, but I, we wouldn't have got this far up that corridor had we not had the uh, computer skill. I think we need. I oh, know, was it? It was him, wasn't it? He is the one that had it, I think. No, maybe not. Was it the girl that kicked it down? I thought it was the guy that had it, but. Uh, oh no, wait, 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 wait. It's me being stupid again. I oh, know, it's not. Just bouncing between him now, aren't I? What's going on? Where's Angela Death? Is it her that kicked it? Yeah, it was. Boom! Go on, get XP for doing that as well. Okay team, we're making progress. You know, I'm wondering if I've missed those. While well, I've been travelling around because of the smoke. Yeah, she's out of ammo again. Now, what I was wondering was, in the midst of all of that, is did somebody else have ammo that she could have had? Because she's got two sets of ammo there, and I'm not overly sure that she's using both types of ammo. Used in small machine guns and handguns. Used in assault rifles and heavy weapons. Yeah, but that's not her, is it? I wonder why you can't give. Or maybe they're, only, they're the only people that can use them. Hmm, that's interesting. Where the hell is she on the... Oh, there she's there. So it is Angela Death. Does she have a... Oh, she's got the red-headed picture. But she definitely didn't come up, did she? I don't think. No, she didn't. So I can't give her those. Or those. Or those. That's Rose. That's one of the guys. And that's one of the girls. This is the problem you've got, you see, because two of them, I can't, I don't know what the pictures are. Well, one of them isn't bare, so that's got to be Stitches. And it could be either of the blokes, but I'm not sure which. So that's a little bit confusing. 
I can only assume that whatever she's using doesn't use those those ammos. There we go. Oh nice, you can pick how many you give them as well. I can give those to her. What has she got with 12 gauge ammo then? Nobody else has got that. I don't want to give her the shotgun shells because they're for her shotgun. God, he's got loads of bullets, hasn't he? He's not even got a gun. And we'll give them to... I mean, what's the face? Stitches. Ah, here you go. Which is which? <laughs> now, I think this one's Stitches because, if I remember rightly, it put the last one I created at the beginning. So, we'll find out in a second. Yeah, well, she's got 12 now. I think she only had two. Whoops. Yeah, and there's Bear. So, yeah, we've got that the right way around. But there's no point in him holding any bullets, that fella. Who are they for, then? What are they? They're... Submachine gun. I don't think anyone's got a submachine gun, have they? I'm giving it a Bear for now, I think. Give them to her. Well, she'll have some bullets now, won't she? There you go. There you go. Right, just check where we're at before we uh, finish up the episode. Well, this has taken us full circle, isn't it? So that... Yeah, you see, that demolition point must have already been there. So I think what we need to do is look for more weak walls, possibly. That's taken us out the other side there. From there. Mind you, we could have got around there anyway, couldn't we? But I think there may well be more of these weak walls kicking around. Well, that's interesting, isn't it? Because we came... All the way up there, I think. Ah, oh, god damn it, Steve. God damn it. Yeah. Lost my bearings a little bit, but it's interesting that we can knock these walls down anyway, is the point. Okay there, I will get back to the main entrance, I think. Get our bearings, and then we will try out the other areas in part five people. It's been an honour and a privilege serving for you again in Wasteland 2. I hope my um, stupidity level hasn't been too high. <laughs> and I haven't looked too dumb in trying to sort these people out. They're all going to turn into pod people by the time I find my way out of this goddamn lab. Anyway, I shall see you in part five, folks. Take it easy. Bye.